stakeholders in Nigeria's oil and gas industry as well as content development are making a case for greater involvement to ensure progress and sustainability in the sector. This sums up the views of stakeholders at a public hearing of the Joint Senate Committee on Local Content and House Committee on Nigeria Content Development and Monitoring held on Monday. The National Assembly says it is taking a new thrust towards local content as a way to achieve capacity development in the oil and gas sector. The three bills under consideration are the Nigerian Oil and Gas Industry Content Development Act, the Nigerian Local Content Enforcement Bill and the Nigerian Oil and Gas Industry Context Act. And the role of CORE is to see to the right to ensure that the right competence, the right materials, the right resources are always there. Early this year, the President and Commander-in-Chief of the Nigeria Armed Forces, President Muhammad Buhari, assented to the current Act 2018, which empowers Korea to regulate engineering in every aspect. They, a lot of companies in the oil and gas industry, they uh, move jobs abroad. And in doing this, uh, it is relatively difficult for us in Nigeria. They, they create what they call center of excellence all over the world. Some are created in Romania, some are created in Paris, and some are created in Bucharest. So they centralize some of these jobs and they are doing them from there. So what this does is that it reduces um, the employment within the oil and gas industry. Today we sat here and the entire country is talking about power problem. Nobody, I mean, any country can be said not to be developed if you don't have oil. But you can't be said to be developed if you don't have power. So power is central to development. And if the logic has worked for oil and gas, power needs something that makes it work. The rationale for separating this bill from the Logic Act is inched on the peculiarity of the oil and gas industry, which we all know remains the bedrock of the nation's economy. As a result, the sector requires a specialized legislation for effective and efficient management of its operations and activities. Another reason for introducing the bill is to ensure that the governance structure of the Logic Act is not distorted. Aside from resources, revenue in oil and gas industry is one goal we have long identified. There are two things to this. First is the real identification of the goal. Second is executing the objective. 